I wanted to film this real quick uh, because we're towards the evening, the last light of day. And you know, that's when crappie generally, generally, most cases, either generally bite first light or last light. Okay, the segment that's coming up right behind me is showing me at last light and they've been they've just been out there snapping so i've been stacking them up you, you, you know how i get down um there are a couple of segments rolling forward at the beginning i'm going to show you guys i've had a lot of questions about my spider rig uh how come the lines don't get tangled i'm going to go into that but right now i'm going to cover with you guys um how i hook my minnow because i've had a lot of people to ask me um exactly how do i hook my minnow so i'm going to go through a, a, a little bit of a, a of an elementary um, uh, animated and i hope that it drives the point home okay this is ms minnow okay you can see her right here right this is ms minnow and how i hook my minnow and before i get to the illustration i want, I want to tell you guys this you have to think about the minnow like you and, and by the way, this is my opinion. This is people have asked me how I do it. And I want to explain this to you. If you hook yourself through the eyes, imagine how long you're going to live. You hook yourself through the brain, imagine how long you're going to live. Hook through the mouth, how long you're going to live. Through the organs, how long you're going to live. But if you hook the ankle, okay, you're going to live a little bit longer. Also a little bit more distress. That's what that minnow gives off. So how I hook my minnow, and I hope you guys can see this. I'm going to hold a little bit closer right there at the end of the tail between that dorsal between that fin and the tail i stay completely away from the organs okay i hook it just like that and when that minnow swims okay their body looks as an act act of desperation they flash that silver side that's what crappy cannot stand so when that wind's not blowing and you got that water glass still and you lower that minnow down there and you got to remember it's hot down there, okay? Because now they're in the summertime pattern, so they don't want to waste a lot of energy chasing after something. So you put that minnow right in front of their face and they look like that minnow is, is in trouble and they're short flashing that silver side, they, they're not going to be able to resist it. So I wanted to show you guys that's, that's how I hook my minnow, right there near the tail, okay? Right there near the tail below that dorsal fin, okay? Stay away from the organs, and your minnow will live longer that way. Okay, I hope that little illustration helps helps you out. Now, real quick, you see I got on the Kings of Born uh, to catch crappie. I want to say this to you guys. For you guys, that a lot of people, my subscribers are just really, really, for my core subscriber and my core viewers, I want you guys, when you get a chance, go on camscrappyhole.com, order your t-shirts. All the items that you see on that on my website, I either, either designed them, approve them, or I worked everything from A to, A to Z to make sure that they're on that site, okay? And everything that you see on there has my name on it. So I'm responsible for it because if anybody out there, all you guys have ever sent me a comment, you notice I answer all comments myself, okay? So you guys can reach me. I'm responsible for this stuff. And let me say this, I would not put anything on that website that I wouldn't wear myself. Okay, it's very important because this is a trust factor. I, I want you guys to trust me, and that's the reason why you view my segment. So, you know, if it's not on there, I don't mess with it. But if you see it, Cam Cam likes it. He's approved it. I've, I've taken it through the, through the ringer. Okay, as a matter of fact, one of these neck pieces I have on my neck, I've had it on for seven months. I haven't even taken it off before. Okay, I shower, I do everything with it on, and it's lasted this long, seven months straight. So, I wanted to say that to you guys, and last and closing before we go to the segment, when you guys order these teas, uh, the Cam's Crappy Hole, and, and the, the, by the way, the Crappy Chicks Tees, man, the sales are going through the roof. We're shipping those things all over the world. I want you, you ladies to be proud to wear those Crappy Chicks Tees because I designed those just for you guys, okay? I want the ladies to be proud of them. So whenever you see someone or you're wearing these tees, I want you to be proud to wear them because this is your hobby. This is what you do. And there's only a certain amount of select people that know about crappie, okay? So if you're catching crappie, you need to congratulate yourself. You know what I'm saying? Pop a collar or two because if you catch crappie, that's a, that's a big thing. So that's, 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 that's boss-like stuff. So listen, let's go ahead and roll to the segment. I want to tell everybody out there I love you guys. I'm looking forward to... Um, to, to showing you this segment and looking forward to answering all the comments and remember eight days a week you can reach me camscrappyhole.com i'm going to have the segment right down there so non-existent um we got cloudy skies we're running a total of six poles today and we're using minnows and as you saw in the illustration of how i hook my minnows 
Uh, we're going to see if we can keep these guys hopping and see if we can get in there and um, get a little bit of love. So listen, also let me, let me say this real quick. I've gotten a lot of um, a lot of my brothers and sisters that are Hispanic. Como esta usted? I want to say what's up to all those guys out there. Uh, que pasa? Uh, I love talking to you guys all, all, all on YouTube and I appreciate you guys subscribing and hollering at me. But listen, we're going to go ahead and get in that hot zone, so sit back and relax, get yourself something to drink, all the crappy chicks, uh, get yourself something to eat, pull your socks all the way up on the crappy sofa and just kick your feet up, sit in your style, however you choose to do it, and we're going to see if we can pull some of these crappy out. Now, we just had Fish Fry Friday, so we still got a freezer full of, of crappy. So, we're going to be catching and releasing. This is for all my grassroots uh, fishermen out there who've been with me a long, 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 long time now. So, sit back, relax. Hang tight, we're gonna see if we can pull some out, all right? We got the marker buoys out. And we're fishing off of a six, seven foot flat. And any of you guys, any of you old heads been around me for a while, you guys know that Crappy Point is a, is a flat, a six foot flat, and around it is like 12, 13 feet, okay? So they come up and they feed. So we're gonna see if we can have a little bit of luck here. Let's creep right in here real quick and let's see what happens. Let me get the camera together. Make sure I got you guys situated. There we go. Perfect. That's your front row seat right over my left shoulder. Fish y'all. God dog it. God dog. <laughs> Let's tag out a tip so we can get ourselves together. <laughs> Guys, that was a nice one. That was a really nice one. That was a nice one. And let me say this to you guys. Listen, when you're crappy fishing, you're going to lose some. Don't even worry about that. Just be excited that you're at the right spot and that they are active and that you found them that they're active. This week is the first week, first week of summer coming up. Summer is just beginning. So you, you remember, once that water temperature warms up, the fish, you have, to, you have to be a little bit patient with them, okay? Just be a little bit patient. Remember, you're fishing. Just that quick. 60 seconds. In the hot zone, just that quick. 11 inch crappie, we're gonna get him off real quick. Let me show him to you. We'll get him off real quick. We got the same hit on the exact same pole, the one we missed right before that. So that tells you right now, this particular pole, the length, has the juice. That's the one we're looking for. So you keep an eye on that one. It's got a big hit on this one. And remember, sometimes they may be finicky. Same pole again. Same exact pole again. The one I just told you guys to watch. 12 inch crop one I just mentioned to you that has the favoritism. This pole here right now has the juice. And it happens that way. <laughs> Look at the size. Guys, this is a 12 inch crappie. Matter of fact, let me put one of these poles down so I can give you guys some scale. Look at that hook set. Right in the roof of the mouth. By the way, I'm using these cam action hooks. <clears throat> Let's see if I can get this bad boy out. Perfect. Let me show them to you. That's a good eating crappie. If you're going to eat, this is a 12 inch crappie. This is what you're looking for. Cam's crappy hole. And what, hey, kings are born to catch crappie. Let's let him go. Remember, we just had Fish Fry Friday, so we've had our fill of these pretty little rascals. Let's get back in that hot zone again. This time we're going to go around the opposite side of the marker buoy. Look at that. Oh man. 
again, they're right there where that tree is. Look at that. Matter of fact, let's throw a marker down right there. Look at that. Oh, wow. Boy. Poor poles are just dropping left and right. Man. Look at that. Look at that. How many poles are just dropping? Make sure we don't hit that marker buoy. Guys, remember, keep an eye on all your poles while you have a fish on. You maybe think that you're calling time out, but you, you gotta remember, you still have active poles in there. Nice 11 inch crosser. Make sure you guys can see him. We're gonna let him go. Not what we're interested in. Whatever little rascal took off. Oh, the poles just started dropping. <laughs> yeah, let me tell y'all something. If you're not having a good time right now, you need to check your poles and see if your heart is beating. So baby, we are crappie fishing. We are crappie fishing. We've been out here every bit of... Matter of fact, i got to get away from this marker buoy because I'm seeing fish down there right, right now. Unbelievable. Wow. Look at all the fish on the monitor. You can see the, you can see the marker buoy right here. Tell you what I'm gonna do. I'm just gonna drift on back, so I don't. I don't want to turn the motor on. Let's just drift on back. Look at that. Look at all those fish. Hmm. Let me see if you guys can see the, the buoy, the marker buoy right there, and you can see all the fish on the screen. And I'm not going to crank it. I just want to make sure I don't get in trouble with that marker. Let's bait back up. These minnows that I'm using right now. I got these minnows five, five days ago, and I've been keeping them five days ago. And you can obviously see the fish that I'm catching. Look at this. Look at that. Ooh, ooh. Look at that. And guys, we are out of the hot zone. Look at that. Good night. Let me put this other pole down. We are out of the hot zone. This is a 12 inch crocker. And we're here in summer. Matter of fact, let me turn around this camera a little bit. Let me show this rascal to you. We're in this, matter of fact, this river over there. Ooh, we were out of the hot zone. Remember, look at that. That hook's so sharp. Look at this big boy. Look at that. Hey, kings are born to catch crappie. If you don't have your tea right now, if you don't have your t-shirts, Cam's Crappy Hole, Crappy Chicks, uh, Kings of Born to Catch Crappy, you've got to go online to camscrappyhole.com. Look at these beautiful rascals. And if you're catching them, order your t-shirt for your family, your wife, your kids, and you wear that 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 t-shirt with pride, baby, because you know what you're doing. You're hooking these little rascals. Let's throw this one back because we already had Fish Fry Friday. And listen, I appreciate all the comments from Fish Fry Friday. We're going to go ahead and let this rascal go. Boy, that's a nice crack. Help me. Oh, healthy crappie. River, you see that crappie? River's on. Little touch of patience is all you're doing. Because the, the water temperature, 82, 83 degrees. So they're... They see your minnow down there. You can best believe that. They see it. Just be a little bit patient. Be a little bit patient, just like that. That's all you got to do. 
That's all you got to do. Just be a little bit patient. Look at that big rascal. Guys, 12 must be the lucky number for the day. Oh. 12 must be the lucky number for the day. Let me say this, still got the hook in his mouth. I want to thank everybody out there, all of my core subscribers, all my viewers. Thank you guys so much uh, for our community platform and how things have been growing for us. And when I, when I say us, without you guys' love and support, we would not be pushing towards 300,000 total views, okay? And I don't necessarily consider myself, look at this, look at this. I can't even talk. <laughs> I can't even talk. Here at this platform, um, it's, it's everybody's platform. As I said on many of my segments, you guys just happen to see me in front of the camera. Okay, but all the love, all the interacting that I do with all of the IMs, all the questions, um, and, and I answer all of those myself, I appreciate you guys so much and all the love, how you've let me into your home. And this segment here is for all the grassroots fishermen that do it from the bank. They've been doing it a long time, uh, 60, 70 year old cats. Um, I love all you guys out there, but this is what it's about. If you got any fries, call, hit me, let me know. Make sure you keep them hot, because Cam's gonna bring the crappy, all right? Thanks guys, I appreciate you. We'll see you next time. Hey fam, if you've enjoyed watching me here at Cam's Crappy Hole and you'd like to see more, click either one of these segments here to the left or you can click either one of these segments here to your right to enjoy more. Keep those hooks wet and we'll see you on the next.